practice there all the time. Um, my parents let me play the shows. Anyone and everyone who, who came out to see us actually paid for a show. <coughs> um, all the bands that we played with along the time that we were real cool with. Hands On, Dynasty, thank you guys for booking us on those shows. Uh, everyone who let us play at their house <laughs> caused a ruckus. <laughs> an apology to Connor. <laughs> uh, yeah, man, straight up. An apology to Connor, you know, for my actions. I was immature. You know, I was looking for something to hate, and he was my first victim. And <laughs> Connor's always been an awesome guy, and he's a real good friend. And he didn't deserve, you know, how I treated him. So yeah, man, apology, dude. And apology to anyone who I've offended, you know, any homies. Um, any homies that I've, you know, just 
let down or, you know, made them feel not loved by me because I love everyone, you know. That's what it's all about. One love, my. <laughs> all right, that's it. Any last words? Um, I love everybody. I love all of our friends. Honestly, the only reason this was ever fun was because all of our friends would show up to our shows. Uh, our music that we would make was based around just being fun. We would actually try to format all of our songs in a way that would be fun, uh, not for us playing, but more so for everyone who was listening and uh, everybody who wanted to kind of participate to that. But honestly, the only reason we ever kept playing was because all of our friends would show up. And if it wasn't for our friend showing up, we would have quit two weeks into it. So, thanks to everybody that ever went to a show. Thanks to everybody that would always take us to shows, that would take all of our equipment. Uh, I remember every single time, I mean, the only person that drives when we were first playing was Yasser. And we could fit a lot of stuff into his car, but, but it still wasn't enough for everything. And I remember, I mean, every single time, no matter where we were going to play or what day it was, we would always, uh, we could always count on MD. We would just text him, call him, and he'd be on it just like that. It didn't matter if we were playing in, I think we played in like San Diego once. It was like ridiculous, far away. And uh, we just hit up MD and just asked him, you know, hey, we got this show going, could you help us out? And without hesitation, he would always just, uh, he would always just come over, he would help us pack stuff into his own car, drive us to the show, enjoy the show, drive us back, and uh, help us put stuff away, so he was, he was the best friend that we had. All day, all day. This is like a really big habit. It hurt me. It just pops all the time and it hurts all the time.